Hey guys, my name is Boots, and this is controller disconnected. Please reconnect the controller. This is Game of Thrones, uh, the first episode. I might do a full series on this. I'm not sure. Uh, first of all, I want to check that the subtitles are on. Uh, display style standard or minimum. Uh, standard, please. Uh, audio video that will be on. Display subtitles. Yes, thank you all. Okay. Right. So let's start our adventure, I guess. I've uh, actually seen this place before. I uh, don't really remember the story. I do know that the first episode ends with a brilliant song, though. I think it's called I Am From Ice, and you should check it out on YouTube if you don't, if you haven't heard it already. <coughs> it's better than Reigns of Castamere. Nah, it's not better than Reigns of Castamere. Okay, let's get it underway. Lord and Screen's taking a while. I'm guessing that's going to be a running theme with this. Seeing as this was probably developed for uh, next gen. The game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. I know, I played The Walking Dead. Okay. For thousands of years, House Forrester have been loyal bannermen to House Stark. In the darkest reaches of the Wolfswood, they harvest the rare ironwood trees. Now the North has been ripped apart by war and rival houses. Seek to clay up. Oh. By war, and rival houses seek to claim Forrester Ironwood for themselves, and the fate of House Forrester hangs in the balance. I was just about to say why. I was just about to say why weren't they fighting with Rob, and then thought, actually, they're already they're actually with Rob here. Yeah. Kingslayer, bold breaker, brought to his knees by the men of the north. But what right? <coughs> <coughs> Does that wolf judge the lion? But what's the sword won't put itself in? I know too many quotes in the front. Okay, let's pick up his sword. Make sure it's faultless this time. Okay. The forester won't be happy with blood and brain. There we go. Now that, a proper sword, I'll have one like it yourself someday. You? I'll never have a sword like that. You might say that as a friend. Even if we're being honest. Oh, don't be an ass, Colin. Apologies, your lordship. <laughs> I'm playing this like a Game of Thrones character. Captain him! And if there's a swear word in there, I'm going to choose it. Next, I'll tell us he got Tyrion, too. <laughs> what, really? I'm a god of my school. Let's do that here and say it was then. You captured the king's Ah! Well, I don't have to lie. That <laughs> round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? What did you mean? Of course, I Not before he dragged you out for it across the battlefield on your face. You're questioning Norrin's <laughs> honor. I'm questioning not a stop. More far fetched every time he tells it. Okay. Get your knee towards some wine. Go on. <clears throat> oh, right. Thanks. You're welcome. Yeah, I'll go and get my lead towards some wine. I'm not going to tell him to do it. Lawrence family has faithfully served House Forest for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach. House Tully is forever in his debt. You've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. Hmm. <coughs> it's you. The night we celebrate. Oh, awesome. Well, nothing bad happens. Run 
Tom Stark, the king in the north. The king, the king, the king in the north. Yeah, where are we? The marks on Casterly Rock. House Forrester has been given the greatest honor. Lead the young Lord Sarney. Ride as the vanguard. Where are we, Harren Hall? Yeah, let's get him. I am from ice. Oh god. <laughs> Thank god everyone cheered otherwise I would look like a right muppet. Okay. Looking a little bit smug there. <coughs> also, I look a little bit like uh, Ramsey Snow. Sound a bit like him, so. Okay, so I'm going to be a knight. It's long overdue. I won't let you down. I'm not going to be smug about it. <laughs> it's long overdue, loud. <laughs> Oh bloody hell, I need to stop moving the control. Yes, my lord. Now go find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Alright. Let's find Roderick. Oh, no Fire. Fetch his ball wine. Can you give me a hand? Come on. Bring it up to you. Do it yourself. Yeah, I've been a spy longer than you, so I'll rank you. You should help me. There's plenty you worse than Norrin, I'll tell you that. No expectations. If I grown up under a big shit show in Scotland, but maybe I'd think suddenly his horse was the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. I suppose it's been big farming. But not by much. Who doesn't know bacon? Uh, I'm just going to be a smart ass my entire life. <laughs> <coughs> All I'm saying is, this week will never be more than this. This is nothing. I've just been told I'm going to be oh, fight actually, man. You'll get that. You'll get that. Easy for you to say. Maybe if my uncle were cast on in the house forest, then I'd feel different. My uncle is. That's nothing to do with Maybe if you'd just been told you were promoted, you might feel different as well. It's right over there. The twins. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> Take your time. You lost a trophy share. You think about all this. Ah, this must be must be the first time we go to the twins, right? It's a nice night for a wedding. It is a nice night for a wedding. Oh, oh bloody hell. I'm doing it again. <clears throat> Something's not right here. Don't expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. Sorry. What? What's wrong?
There's nothing wrong with me, mate. Nothing at all. Bloody hell. Uh, I don't see a boy. What about? What the hell is that about? Slow down, Richard. What's the rush? We got fucking run. I don't think running, running would just alarm, alarm, I think. <laughs> to find Roger. <laughs> we have to find. Oh crap. I guess it's right stick to do that. Bloody hell, tell me. Do you want to tell me how to do the things before you shove them on the screen? Good job, we've got fast reflexes. I'd have been dead then. Nice one, Roger. Get off me. Oh, right, okay. Oh, thank God. I mean, shield I, I don't think, I think I might have failed, man. <coughs> Behind you. Somebody's running at you with a spear, eh? Huh? Extent. Absolutely no way he's going to come back in the next episode. <clears throat> nice one, Bowen. Bloody hell. He's not even dead. Could have checked his checked his pulse or something, you know. He got stabbed in the oh, hang on, let me get a sword. He got stabbed in the back of the leg, and then a horse fell on him. He's not dead. I'm pretty sure I picked up my sword though. Oh, Rami Legion wants to. Time. You should go, actually. Come on. We have to keep moving, my lord. 
You got shot in the arm. <gasps> oh, bloody hell. He's going to sacrifice himself, isn't he? Valerian steel. Nice. Take it. I'll do as you command, my lord. I'm not going to stop now, going. I don't want you to die. Tell your uncle. No one but him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan. All right, I swear. Swear that I will, my lord. Okay. It's those foresters. Now go. For your honor, you must do this for your home. What do we say to death, Ruth. my boy? Kill those fucking foresters. Not today. Yeah, he's fighting off. No, he's dead. Sorry, did, did you think he was going to have an heroic death? Did you forget you were watching Jim Browns? Through the night. A little bit. I'm sorry, guys. I am really sorry. It's King's London. First episode of Game of Thrones. Land from Ice. Okay. Then a loading screen? Okay, the loading screen wasn't that bad. Well, he's made it home. Looks like he's used that sword as well. Or maybe it was just dirty. Okay. Go for it. Completely forgot about this part. Shit, the blood. Blood. Oh, I can, I can do a fast run. It's alright, it was just pig's blood. Oh no. Okay, I was going to try and investigate that pig, but... <clears throat> Let's go to the fire. Look at this car. My father's car. Oh no. 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 I really don't want to walk towards these guys, to be honest. Why are they just killing pigs? So long, boy. It's not the boy you need. Okay, I will move along. Oh, oh. I see you move on. Unless you want to be fed in the fucking pigs. Oh, God's sake. I'm going to kill you. Is that so? You can try if you like, and then we'll feed you to the pigs. Get off my 
land. This is Dalton land now, boy. Oh, oh Dalton. Shit. It's the new boy, number one. I reckon you'd like a proper lovely son like that. <clears throat> oh, <laughs> hello. A little quick time events that I knew nothing about <laughs> because nobody told me. I'll have that sword, boy. Now normally there's prompts on the screen to teach you how to do this stuff. I you'll have it. Alright, let's get him. <laughs> Well, even if I do the prompts right, I'm getting quite battered. So. He's taking the sword. Uh, I'm gonna go with the axe. Down you go. You just killed somebody. He didn't know that was gonna happen, did he? Well, I mean, that, that might have been the first time he's ever killed somebody. These are trained soldiers. Apparently not. Make sure you kill them all. Thanks, controller. Drop the knife, get down on the floor and die. Okay. I missed the prompt, but apparently that didn't matter. No. No survivors. No survivors. Kill him. Damn it! He's gonna get away, isn't he? Have mercy, please. I know I just murdered your father and probably your entire family. Mercy. The sister. Oh, she did. Oh, fucking hell. I tried to stop them. That's where are you and the hound find them. <laughs> I'll kill the man who did this. Well, well, no, you won't. <laughs> the man who did this are way above your league, lad. Ramsey fucking bolt. Actually, one of my favourite characters in Game of Thrones is Ramsey Snow. He's still a dick. It's just because Owen Reed plays him. Well, I like Misfits. I've still got the sword, so that's a plus, I guess. Oh, it's Duncan. It's too late. They're already dead. Bring the maester. Meet us in the Great Hall. Quickly. Yes, sir. Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. All oh, right, so the other two were White Hills. And for what? My sister, she... She was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, Maester. All right, so the Maester's okay. Late hot tea. I should be able to save your name. Should. Your justice was swift. 
Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the white hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. It was justice. They got what they deserved. They did indeed. I guess it was a kind of justice. Not really, though. These maggots want to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? I'm going to have a bit more with justice. Okay. I got left stick. Oh, for God's sake, that's disgusting. Oh, lovely. Let's just close it, shall I? Yeah. I'll leave that with my leg. Oh. It's a dark day's idea. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Our house will never fall. I think once let's hope you're right. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Yes, it is. Young and altogether unprepared to leave. Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? <clears throat> I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrest has saved your life. He did. Odd though that he chose to save you, the squire, and not his son, Roderick. Well, he's not already dead. In hand with himself. He's as good a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of warcraft. Roderick had already fallen. There was nothing we could do. Mm. Although I'd imagine Lord Forrester would sacrifice himself to save anyone from his house. I all know. Lady Forrest I don't think he did it. I don't think he like did it to save him. I think he just knew he was going to die. Any on that uh. That looks it's fine. Go Perfect. On. Good as new. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. In other words, let me walk around the room and have a look at things. So this is a tapestry, and we're going to uh, meet all the characters here. <clears throat> or all the characters in House Forester, anyway. So here we've got Asher. Asher. Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. So he's in Essos, which is where around where uh, Danny is in the TV show. In fact, I think she's in Marin. Hmm. Maybe. Tyler and Ethan. I suppose Lord Ethan now. Yeah, but so he's the one that's going to inherit uh, the land. No, yeah. still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although, I wonder if they'll bring her home. Mm, she's in King's Landing, okay. Lady Forrest has always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a forester myself. She's a nice lady. Yes. Oh, yeah. Never easy being a fourth born son. Alright, that's Ryan. Lord Forrester. It was an honour to Squire Horn. Gregor the Good. Gregor. That's a that's a unfortunate name to have. Okay. He's our best warrior by far. Lucky he's not dead. Or is he? Hmm. You seem to be favouring him. Always sad to see a warrior lose a limb. I'm fine. Here's what's in here. Look. I'll show you. Okay. Look at Gore's chair. Wait, he's bloody threatening to cut my leg off. Alright, I think we're going to leave it there for today. There's the Lord's chair. That's a window. Let's look at the window. Yeah, I'm good. Oh, I thought he was just gonna walk up to the window and then walk away. And some of the funniest stuff in The Walking Dead. Alright, I will see you guys in a bit. I hope you enjoyed this first episode of the Game of A Game of Thrones, episode one. Yeah, I'll see you soon.